Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm just looking at our chart to make sure that we have you scheduled in for today. Were you here for that cranial nerve exam? Okay. Good stuff. Can I just confirm your first and last name? And can you spell that out for me? Okay, and now spell it backwards. Okay. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Yep. And what is your birthday starting with the year, then the month, then the day? Okay. Good. Oh, wow, you're mighty old. Okay. And um, can you just tell me what your address is? Oh, we do have it in the system, but I'm not, I'm not sure if this is right. You know, it might have been updated since the last time you were here. Okay. All right. Nope, we did not have the right address. Okay. Um, all right, so we're going to start off with like a few health questions. Uh, there's probably a reason why you're here, right? I'm hoping that everything is okay. But you might be here for a checkup since you might not be feeling well. Is that right? Oh, gosh. Okay, so you're not feeling too bad. You're just, you're wanting here yearly checkup, but we're going to make sure that this is a full cranial nerve exam um, since you aren't feeling the best, you know. You might be lacking in vitamin D. That's something that, you know, some people are lacking right now. And seasonal depression is something that's, you know, been going on as well. And I have seasonal depression, so I understand if you, you know, haven't been feeling the best because of, you know, the season's changing and fall is here and the sun isn't shining as much as it, you know, usually would be in the summertime. Okay, so just a few more questions and then we'll be good to go. We'll be starting the exam there. So number one, have you had any vertigo, uh, any blurriness in your vision or your ears? Do you feel like you can not hear as well as you could before? Or maybe your mouth hurts. Do you have any mouth sores or anything like that? Anything weird and abnormal that you didn't see before or you didn't feel before, okay? And when did that start? Oh, I'm so sorry about that. I've actually had that before too, and it's not the most comfortable. But we can make sure that, you know, if you've got a little bit of an upset stomach or anything like that, you know, vitamin C will help you with that. So since your stomach hasn't feeling the best, let's definitely get you some vitamin C and hot soup always helps also. Okay, I'll be, I'll be doing a prescription for the vitamin C there because that will definitely help. Okay, so a little bit of a stomach upset. Um, but nothing else really abnormal. You've just been a little bit tired. Okay. Well, how much have you been sleeping? Okay. How many hours a night do you get? So eight hours, is, seven to eight hours is actually pretty good. Um, is that every night though? Okay. So it's not every night. Some nights you have late nights. Okay. Well, having a regular sleep schedule is super important. Um, but I know that sometimes it's not doable, right? So. Maybe that's something you can, you know, work on. Because I think that sleep is the most important thing um, that you can have for your health. Sleep is super important, especially for me. I need a lot of sleep. Okay, all right, we are ready to start the exam. And what I'm gonna do, first of all, is put my gloves on. And I'm gonna check for any bumps or anything on your head. Are you still comfortable? Great. All right. So we're going to start off with top of your head, you know, top of your head. I'm going to scratch it a little bit. On the left, we're going to go behind the head. Okay. And now right, right above, right above your head, right above your eyes, I mean, right here on your forehead. Do you feel any pain when I'm pressing on your head? Okay, and then going on the right here. Any pain at all? No. Good. In the back of your head, I'm just going to go on the back of your head right here. And then I'm just going to push your hair back. Okay, and I'm just going to probably take your neck here. I think that's by the neck. 
Okay, how about your chest? Nothing there. And your shoulders. No pain? Okay, good. That's good news so far. All right, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to check your eyes. I want you to just close your eyes, and I'm going to see if your eyes hurt when I go like this, okay? Okay. You can open your eyes again. Good. Now I'm going to check your sinuses, and I'm going to press on them a little bit harder than probably most doctors do, but I want to see if you've got some sinus issues there at all. Okay, nothing there. Okay, and how about sort of by your cheeks? Okay, and then just your chin, 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 chin. Okay, so I'm going to want you to open your mouth right now. Okay, open your mouth. Open your mouth like, ah, uh, okay. And now don't let me close your mouth. Good job, good job, good job, okay? Now look at me. Just look at me, look at my nose, okay? I'm going to try to turn your head, and I don't want you to let me, okay? Okay, good job. Now I'm gonna to try to turn your head that way. I want you to just keep looking at me, don't let me turn your head. Good, okay, perfect. All right, so we're gonna take a look into your nose with my light here, okay? And so I'm just going to just take a look into your nose there. Hmm, nothing looks weird. Good, good. Okay, and I want you to open your mouth again, and I'm going to look into your mouth. Yeah, open your mouth. Now, obviously, I'm not a dentist, but I'm looking at your tonsils. You do have pretty big tonsils. You do have a few tonsil stones. Do you uh, wash your mouth out with um, mouthwash every day? You know, if you don't do that, these tonsil stones can start to build up and they look really, they don't, I mean, they don't, I mean, they look sort of weird also, but the biggest thing is that they make your breath smell weird. And I, yeah, <laughs> ooh, <sighs> okay, yeah. Wash your mouth out with either mouthwash or salt water, whichever one works for you, okay? And I do wanna just get a sample of your saliva, okay? So just, oops, let me use this side. I just want to look at, just want to get a sample of your saliva here. Yes, there. Okay, perfect. Thank you for that. This will be going into the lab. Right. Okay, so now we're going to be using this to check your uh, pulse. Okay, and so I'm just opening this up and I want you to put your arm in here, okay? So put your arm in here. Good. Good. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay, and I'm gonna take a look at this while I pump it up. And you're gonna feel slight pressure on your arm. Okay, do you feel that pressure? Good. Yes, I understand it's getting tighter and tighter. Don't worry about it. This is normal. This is absolutely normal, okay? Okay, just a few more pumps. All right, um, that's quite tight. I understand that. I'm just doing some counting here. Okay, and now we're going to release. We're going to release it now, okay? Okay, perfect. So your pulse is about 120 over 70. So it's just pretty normal, pretty normal, okay? And now I'm going to check your lungs to see if we've got any crackling or anything going on in your in your lungs, okay? And then what I want you to do is just breathe in for me. Okay, breathe in for me. It's gonna be a little bit cold, but it'll be okay. I'm gonna put this right under your chest, okay? Breathe in. Breathe out. Good, breathe in. Breathe out. Good, okay, now I want you to breathe in again, and I want you to hold it for three seconds, okay? So breathe in, as deep as you can, hold for three, two, one, and breathe out. Good, okay. 
Yes, your heart rate is, it's pretty good. Uh, you seem a little nervous, but you know, usually when you're getting a checkup, I understand it. You can be a little nervous for that. I know I am when I go to the doctor. All right, so we're gonna start off with the exams, like the eye exam, we're gonna test your sense of taste, smell. We already sort of did touch, but I wanna make sure that you can definitely, you know, feel it when I go like this on your face. So just let me know once again if you can feel that everywhere on your face. Just, I'm gonna do it everywhere, okay? Good, okay, I'm glad that you could feel all that. All right, so we're gonna test your reflexes now, okay? And so just look straight at my nose, and look straight at my nose, and yes, okay, look straight at my nose, good. Sorry about that, I didn't mean to hit you there. <laughs> Hope you're okay. Okay, now look at my left eye, good, okay, good, good. You definitely flinched a little bit there, and that's what I was looking for. And so, did you feel this on your? Do you feel this on your arm? On your arm, okay. And on your knees. Good. Good. Okay. So your reflexes are working. That's awesome. All right. And now we will be doing the eye exam portion. So I want you to just look straight at my nose if you can. Okay. Good. Ignore the light. Good. Now I want you to follow the light. Good. Keep following. All right. Uh, tell me how many fingers I'm holding up. Good. How about now? Good. How about now? Good. How about now? Good. Okay. And let's do the other side. So just ignore the light for me. I want to just take a look into your eyes. Okay. Just focus right here. Okay. Good. Okay. Now I want you to follow the light. Follow the light. Okay. Follow the light, follow the light, follow the light. Good, and follow the light again. Okay, and now I want you to just tell me how many fingers you see holding up here. Okay, and now I want you to tell me when the light comes into your vision, but I want you to look at my nose, okay? Good, 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 good. Okay, now I want you to tell me which fingers are moving, okay? I want you to tell me when you can see the fingers coming into your vision and how many. Good. 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 Good job. You're doing amazing. All right, so now I'm going to check to see if you can see colors. I've got some Sharpies here. Some Sharpies, okay. And can you follow this Sharpie with your eyes? Keep following it, keep following it. Good, 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 okay. And just tell me what color it is. Yes, that is right, okay. Follow this Sharpie. And what shape am I making right now with it? Good, good, what color is it? Good job. Next, follow it really quick for me. Good, and what color is it? Awesome. And this one's similar to the last one, but it's a little bit different, right? The last one was pink and this one is purple, exactly. And this one, if you could just follow it, what color is it? Okay, what shape am I making with it? Good job, good job, good job, good job, good job, good job. All righty, and so what I wanna do is I wanna see if you can feel this, okay? So stick out your tongue and let me know if you can feel this on your tongue because we don't know if your tongue can feel anything, right? So let's see if your tongue can feel that. Okay, good. And now we're going to do it on your nose, okay? So do you feel that on your nose? Good. Okay, how about your ears? How about your ears? How about your ears? Let's see if you can feel it on your ears. Let's see if you can feel it on your ears. Okay. Good. Let's do the same thing with the stapler. 
Yeah, let's do the same thing with the stapler, okay? Yep, they're done. Good. Did you feel that? Does it hurt a little bit? Yeah. We'll get those staples out of your tongue shortly, but let's try to see if you can feel it. Can you hear this? Can you hear this? Okay. Can you hear this? Can you hear this? Which ear can you hear this? Which ear can you hear this? Good job, good job. Okay, let's get that staple out of your tongue. Okay, let's just get the staple out. Let's just get that staple out. There we go, there we go, got it. Awesome. Okay, next I wanna to check to see if you can smell this. Okay. What does that smell like? Yes, this is Vicks. Whew, strong. I love this stuff when I'm not feeling well. Want me to put a little bit on your chest? Sure. Want me to put a little bit under your nose? Sure. It's cooling, isn't it? I'm gonna put some on my nose and my chest. Yeah, that feels, that feels, mm, love it, feels good. Cools you off, cools you right off. Okay, so you, um, we're almost done, okay? I want to see if you can taste this. So I've got a little bit of liquid in here. I want you to tell me if you can taste that, okay? Okay, open your mouth. Sorry, I know I told you I wouldn't make you open your mouth again, but this is just to taste this. Yes, yes, strawberry. Good job, that is strawberry. Okay, and let's try something else. Let's try this. Okay. Yes, that tastes like orange. Yes, exactly. I want you to smell this. Yes, that's true. It is bio oil, bio, bio oil, bio oil. Okay, all right. Now we want to do a few, a few card questions. Okay, so let me know what shape is this exactly. What shape is this? Exactly. Oops. And what shape is this? And what color is it? Good. Good job. Great job. And I have this chart with these little birds on here. And I want you to just tell me how many birds you see. So can you count the birds? Okay. Good job. No, a birdie fell off. We have to put the birdie back on. <gasps> no, don't fall off, birdies. Keep flying. Okay. How many bluebirds do you see? One, one, two, three, four, five. Right. One, two. Okay. How many pink ones? How many pink ones? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. How many yellow ones? One, two, three, four. Good job, okay. And how many little leaves do you see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, good job, good job. Okay, and I have this chart here. What letter is this? Good, 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 what does this spell, Han? Yes, and this? And this letter right here. Good. This letter right here. Can you read this letter? Can you read this letter? Can you read that one? Okay. And you can read that one. Good. How many 
O's do you see? How many O's do you see? Okay, how many S's do you see? Good. How many K's do you see? Okay. All right. Well, we are done with the exam today. I think that you did an amazing job. And I'm going to give you a prescription for your stomach so that you can feel better. But all your nerves, reflexes, everything is everything is working properly. You did a great job. I'm glad that you came in. I know that was a little bit long. Sorry about that. <laughs> I hope that you can still have a good rest of your day, even though you spent 20 minutes here. But let me get you that prescription really quick, okay? And then you'll be on your way. Okay. And you'll just go see the doctor and she'll give you what you need, okay? There you go. Okay, well, thank you for coming. I hope you have a good night's sleep and we'll see you next time.